Hey there techies, this is Kat from Payload Studios again and today we're going to be doing a video on flying in Tyrotech. Now there are many different types of flying machines that you can create but in this video we're mainly going to focus on planes as it's something that many of us struggle with. I need to say a huge thanks to the development team and some of our forum members who offered a lot of helpful tips. Unfortunately we're not going to be able to include everything in this video but I've put a link in the description if you want more details on flying. So here's our top tips. Number one. The key factors of flight are lift, propulsion and weight. Add more wings to add lift, add boosters and propellers for propulsion and try to keep weight as low as possible. Don't add anything unnecessary at first and also try to keep it light, just like you would with a real plane. Backwards and upside down spoilers can also help with lift, but try to get the wings right first. As a rule, the heavier your plane is, the more lift you will need to keep it in the air. Don't forget some landing gear wheels to help you in takeoff and landing. Number two, to begin with, try building your craft fairly small and symmetrical, as balancing the weight of your plane is key. If it looks the same on both sides, then it should make your job easier. Try to focus on the overall balance before you add things such as weapons and gyros. Number three, if it looks like a real plane, it will probably work. Build things that replicate the shapes that real planes are. Try to put the wings in similar locations, Two larger wings in the middle, a long thin fuselage as the backbone and two small tail wings with a first rudder will help keep it stable in the air. Remember that Tarotech is a physics based game so replicating what works in real life is a good way to start. Number four, start simple. As we mentioned earlier, it is incredibly important to start out simple with your planes. Don't worry about adding weapons to begin with and don't start off by trying to build a car plane hybrid as these can be difficult to make. You need to think about your craft's centre of gravity as well and you'll need wings either in front of or behind the centre of gravity or both in order to control elevation. Get some propellers on the nose or under the wings, get boosters on the tail or under the wings as well. Remember that fuel tanks are heavy, so try not to put too many on your craft. Number five, planes that sit on the ground with their nose at a slightly raised angle are easier to get into the air than those that are perfectly horizontal. If the nose or wings are facing downwards, it will never leave the ground. Number six, remember your takeoff techniques. During takeoff, clear a large flat area ahead of you. Hold W and shift until the plane leaves the ground. Once in the air, release W and tap shift instead to angle upwards. The up and down controls flip once you leave the ground and release W for the first time. Whilst in the air, a light touch is required. Feather the controls with small adjustments and don't be heavy handed. Also, if your tech is lightweight, it should be easy to maneuver in the air, just like this little craft we're using here. Community tips. At first, try to get your tech flying without gyros as gyros can lessen manoeuvrability of the tech. If a tech flies stable without gyros and thrusters or motors, it is well balanced. If wing types and plane concepts are something that you struggle with, try looking up some aerodynamic tips online for inspiration. Don't forget that the options are almost limitless, so at the end of the day, implementing trial and error might be the most effective way for you to create a great flight tech. Also, don't give up. Start small and grow that thing. And if you ever need any help, then head over to our forum where we'd be more than happy to help you out. I'll post the link in the description. Thanks very much for watching guys, again if you want any more in-depth advice as well as advice for creating drones and helicopter type techs, then head over to the forum thread which again is in the description below. Until next time techies, thanks for watching.